chastity is important to me because it is the base of love, it is the base of charity. Um, we owe it to ourselves, we owe it to our neighbor to live chaste lives. It's something that God asks us to do. He asks us to live chastely. Even married couples, he asks to live a version of chaste life. I have made the personal decision to remain abstinent or practice abstinence because I've seen what an unchaste life can be like and what it can do, the wounds and the pain it can cause, the shame that people can feel from not living an ordered life, not living chastely, and so turning upside down what God has ordained. Dressing modestly is, is important to me because it protects me. Uh, it protects my innermost self and all of the parts of me that are important and intimate. It helps people see me as a whole person and not just one part or another. Uh, it also protects the other folks who, who might be uh, seeing me so that they don't have that lustful sin or they're not tempted to have that lustful sin. Um, sometimes dressing immodestly is provocative. Um, it oftentimes when we think about what we're going to wear, what, what are we actually putting on, what is our intention? I try to keep that in mind. Um, anytime I'm going out or dressing up, uh, what's my intention for the clothing that I'm wearing? Am I looking to cause someone to sin even slightly? Uh, do I want them to see me in an immodest way? God calls us to dress modestly so that we are protected. Those people around us see us as the whole person and we are not causing other folks to sin and we are protecting ourselves as well as them, not provoking any lustful intentions. Now, you might be wondering how to dress modestly. Men and women both can achieve modest dress in any situation by following a few tips. First, ask yourself how much bare skin is exposed and does this outfit reflect respect and the dignity I'm born with? For men, wear well-fitting pants. Pants that are too tight may expose sacred areas. Pants or swimwear that's too loose so that it's falling to the ground is undignified. For women, fashion and dress and clothing can be an expression of your personality, and that's wonderful. You can still dress modestly and still love fashion. When wearing shirts, Make sure they don't scoop too low. Use the four finger rule. Place four fingers from your collarbone and if your shirt is lower than that, it is too low or it's not as modest of a shirt. You can employ the use of an undershirt or a camisole to help bring that shirt level up even if it's your most favorite low cut shirt. When wearing shirts that have Thin straps or exposed parts of your back, throw a cardigan over them. That way it'll cover those areas up. In the summer months, sometimes it seems even harder to dress modestly because more clothing means more heat. But you can still employ modest dress by wearing large flowing dresses or large flowing skirts to allow for more airflow and cooler temperatures. And you can pizzazz up your modest outfit with some fun jewelry, some bright clothing colors, or even a sporting a good handbag.